Hi friends, how are you? This is the Cold Donut speaking, and welcome back to some more Tekken Classic, and today I'm here to present you with a potential solution to uh, the issues we were having with bringing back items if they don't go into a chest. Now what I think actually, uh, as I'm placing down tubing here and coming up with a solution, because, uh, and I just realized this now as I started the video, that's my great luck there, um, I realized just just a second ago, uh, just a second ago, that I shouldn't have a problem with the pneumatic tubing going through uncolored pipes, because in pneumatic tubes, items actually will go to the first inventory they can find that they're allowed to pass through. So I'm pretty sure that I'm not going to need to worry about uh, items going through. Uh, piping that they really aren't supposed to, and going farther back than where their colored tube is. What I was going to do, and I was preparing for just now, and was about to tell you before I realized this, was I was going to loop it back through, uh, I was going to bring the pneumatic tube back up here and restart the cycle, but I'm pretty sure that this is actually unnecessary, uh, because pneumatic tubes go to, uh, items in pneumatic tubes go to the first inventory they are allowed to reach. So, let's say we're making a cobble chest, right? Um, actually, no, let's put the cobble farther back. Um, nah, it doesn't really matter. Um, but I kind of want to put something more important there. So let's say we were putting our ingots there, right? So let's dump off a bunch of stuff real quick. Um, buckets of water and all that sort of stuff. We need to just kind of dump some things off, because we have a little too much of it. Um, so let's say we wanted our iron to go in there, uh, and let's say we converted all of it to ingots and whatnot, and did that. Say we wanted iron to go in red. Then it shouldn't go farther back, because the first inventory will be at red. Um, let's see. So let's say we wanted iron and copper and tin, and our silver, and our bronze, and, uh, gold. I think there are only five slots, is that true? Yeah, there are only five, so I'm over the limit already. But let's say we put all our high-use metals into this one. Or, what if we had, uh, industrial craft metals and, uh... Industrial craft metals, and then maybe, uh, I don't know, red power metals? We could do that. So let's say we had a red power metal one, so that would be this one. And then this is industrial craft and normal metals that would go here, I guess. Uh, would be how we did it. Uh, do I have a blue alloy ingot? No, so I can't put that in there. Um... I guess we could do steel. Refined iron, that's what I really want to put in. Uh, so we could just have pretty much an entirely industrial craft uh, sorting machine section. So that's industrial craft ingots. And then we could have like normal Minecraft stuff. Uh, so gold we would put there, redstone, lapis, um, coal, charcoal. We would put all those in there, then, I think. So we would have a different section. Uh, eventually, we're actually going to get to the sorting machine stuff, but right now I'm just trying to come up with a system. So we would have gold, and lapis, and redstone, and coal, and charcoal in this chest. No, and diamonds, diamonds. We'll put diamonds in this one. Diamonds, 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 diamonds. Okay. This is kind of a weird system already, I, I know. Um, we'll get on that. What about, we could do bronze in here, because maybe it's less used. We could put, like, less used ingots in this side, and more commonly used ones on the other side, because these are the less used ingots. These are probably the more valuable stuff. And this is, like, miscellaneous valuables, I guess. Um, if that makes any sense, I don't really know. Uh, this is kind of getting complicated and weird, but 
I'm trying to do the best that I can on the fly here to come up with a sorting system that will work, guys. Uh, obviously, let me know what you think about what we can do here and what will make sense. But I am trying to come up with something that is going to have a decent sorting system. So this would be uh, gems we'll put here. Uh, ingots, less commonly used ingots, miscellaneous mining uh, supplies. This I think we'll put in with you guys because you're valuable in terms of EMC. Charcoal, I guess I can put in that one, uh, where the coal is now. Steel, I need a place for steel eventually if we ever get into railcraft, so I guess I'll put that in. Uh, we'll put it in this one. Now that's less commonly used. Let's move... No, not silver. Let's move red alloy to here. And we'll do it like this. Sure, and just because I like the colors to match up, we'll put it up like that. Sure, okay. Um... Charcoal, right. Charcoal would go there. What else have I not used? Um, I think I've used pretty much everything that's an ingot. So then we would have our uh, red power stuff. I think Nicolite should be the last addition to this section. Like that. And then that's already a lot of items, guys. But I'm going to keep working this out on camera, because I think this is relatively important. Um, we'll put EMC in this one. Put some more of that in there. Okay, we can dump this all off. Uh, what else would I put in that one? I don't know, what is this section even really there for? This is, like, I guess, equivalent exchange stuff? I don't know, it's, it's a little weird. Um... Yeah, this is our equivalent exchange junk and whatnot. Um, I guess I could throw that in there, but I'm not going to. Now, let's let's keep going. Uh, I don't really think I actually want this. This isn't a very important chest, and it takes up a whole nother slot. So I'm going to move that out of there. Um, here's how I think we're going to do it then, guys. We are going to... Uh, let's see. Red is already in here, right? So, let's first just test this out. Um, because I do want to show you guys how it would work. And we have a red paintbrush, right? Yep, red. And then we would have a chest. And this is going to get problematic because there is a torch right here. We'll move it over. Um, because I need to break this and then have a chest in there. So we can get a double chest, right? Do we have chests? Please? Alright, fine, we'll break this one. We will break it and make more using lapis, as we always do. Um, let's go quickly get that done. I know it's just a little bit of a slow start so far today, because um, we actually haven't really gotten a whole lot done, but there's a lot coming here, guys. We are almost ready to get this sorting machine fired up. Uh, let's see, so we're going to need this in there. And we're gonna have you here. And let's say I dumped... Oh, does this need power? I think this needs power. Yeah, it does. Uh, we're gonna need to make a... We're going to need to make a uh, solar panel for it. We're gonna need to make a solar panel or move the one we have uh, for that purpose. And we are gonna cut into this wall, apparently. I did not plan this out well enough. Oops. That's all right. So that's how that would work, and then we would have chest, uh, dig, okay, and then we would have another one like that, and then we would have another one here, boom, okay, and this one would have to move over, back that way, sure, okay, there we are, and lots of chests. So if we ever actually had enough colors for this purpose... Uh, it would look like that. Now, we don't have enough colors for that purpose yet. Um, and we don't have... Well, I think we have what? Um, it's eight. We have eight colors, one of which is a default. So one, two, three, four. And then one, two, three would be our starting, uh, our starting color. Also, I dug out this little top section. So eventually, when we start using the sorting machine more, 
Uh, and it actually ends up being our source of, uh, well, our main storage system. Which someday I hope it will be, because it's a pretty cool device. Um, when that happens, we will uh, need to be able to run through here and quickly look into all the chests. So that's why that's there. Uh, but anyway, let's go make ourselves a little more uh, uh, in the way of chests. Now let's take this back out. And let's go ahead and keep placing them down. Boom, boom. Boom. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. Okay. And if we come down here, we can remove this, move you over, and there we are. So, we have a lot of chests in here. Probably more than we are ever going to need. Uh, but, we have them uh, for whatever future purposes they may be required for. Oop, drop one. So this is the general layout, guys. Uh, eventually we may add a second sorting machine. Uh, but so far, uh, this, is, this is where it's going, guys. So, let's hop up here. I'm thinking once we get through four, uh, we're probably going to have another sorting machine. And then it'll sort the next set until we run out of things we need to categorize. But these are our first four categories. The next category is wood. Um, so we're going to have chests and uh, planks and logs and all that sort of stuff. So this and this and this are the other things that are going to go in that section. Because these are the wood logs that we have available to us right now. And then this is the wood that you get. So that's the wood chest. Um, armor I don't think I'm going to make a chest for. Cobble and dirt I do want to make uh, a single chest for. So cobble... And then dirt, and then the other one is the default color, so we don't need to use that. So, we have just about everything done here. Um, let's line up some pneumatic tubes for all the different categories. Seven, and then I think we're actually going to delete this chest. Break, and break. Okay. And you know why, guys? I'll, I'll let you know why. So, uh, that chest is going to be in the spot that our next sorting machine is located at. Because uh, our next sorting machine is going to be right here, I believe. Um, so we're going to pull into this chest for the default. And then... No, we need to move this one farther back, I believe. Um, yeah, so we would go like... No, 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 no. Uh... Colored items can go through colored or uncolored tubes. Uh, that, that's how that works. So it would go through to here. We have a sorting machine. Pull it out here. These chests are off by one. Here, can I change this mode? Low focus, long range, horizontal mining, scatter. Low focus. No, shoot it. Shoot at this chest. All right, fine. It won't shoot at it. We'll, we'll just break it. With our axe, totally. All right, let's get this done. Um, so these would move back to uh, the wall behind them. We would go like this. And like this. You would break. And then we would do this. And we would dig in here. And I do want to do a little more for you guys. I know uh, we are getting close to 15 minutes here uh, for our time. But I really want to make sure we can get a little bit of progress done. Uh, accomplished here, rather. Because uh, I think that would be pretty cool if we could get some, uh... Get some stuff done and almost have the sorting machine ready to get started. Because I think we have a solid blueprint here. This is how it's going to look. It's going to be like this. Like that. And like that. Can I even place that down? No, I can't. Man! There we are, and thanks. And do we have more pneumatic tombs? Yes, we do. And sorting system. That's the sorting system layout that we're going to be rolling with. Uh, eventually, we'll extend that farther back, but this is what we have so far. And I'm liking it a lot. So, next, what we need to do, guys, is do a quick test, I think. Uh, well, we can't do a test today because we don't have a solar panel. But we will uh, 
uh, do a test soon. What we're going to do now is make another paintbrush. Um, what's the next color we have to do? Green. Okay. And then I kind of want to do light blue instead, because I think that's more frequently used. So light blue, light blue dye, lapis and bone meal. Okay. Uh, lapis, bone meal, where are you? Uh, lapis, I have bone meal. Bone meal! Okay. There we go. And let's make ourselves some light blue dye. Okay, we have that. And then, what is it? It's a paint bucket and then two flax? How, how do you make this? Oh, it's, it's gotta be empty! How can I, how can I craft an empty paint can? Is it only... Is it really only with tin plates I can't, like, empty a paint can? Man, that's annoying. I have to make a whole bunch more tin plates? Alright. Fine. 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 Okay. I'll do it. I'll do it. Alright. Alright, if, if, if you're gonna be that way, we'll, we'll do this. I'll just dump off some miscellaneous blocks here real quick. And yes, I have some uh, marble hanging out there where it's not supposed to be. But that's okay. Uh, we're gonna take this tin, and we're gonna make a bunch of tin plates, because we have a lot of colors to get. Uh, let's quickly check here. So, we have, uh, how, how many does it take for a tin plate? Four tin plates takes two iron and one tin. We need to make eight buckets, seven more buckets. We need seven more buckets, so that would be, seven times four would be... Not enough. Wait, seven times four would be seven sets of four, so we need eight sets of this. So we need 16 iron and eight tin? I think is how that would work. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. If I'm, I I'm breaking a rule of how people aren't supposed to do math on camera and all that sort of stuff. Uh, that's not something people usually like to do. Uh, math on, on video because you tend to mess it up when you're talking. Uh, but I'm doing it here, so we'll see how this goes. Anyway, let's go get those tin plates. Um, let's see. All right, we've got a few. We're out of power. And it's nighttime, so we're not getting any more. Uh, that's bad. All right, so we're going to sleep here, and unfortunately, we're not going to be able to paint the sorting machine system today, but at the very least, I hope you have a better idea of how it's going to work. Um, the sorting machine will be right here, the next one we make, uh, and all that. Uh, I hope you have enjoyed. Uh, I guess I'm starting the intro a little too early because I do want to check on the tin plates. Yeah, they're still going. We're, we're getting a little bit of power here. So, I hope you have enjoyed. Please remember to like and subscribe if you did. This is from the Call Donuts speaking. Goodbye, friends, and I will see you all next time with some more Tech It Classic, in which we will get paint, paint these uh, pneumatic tubes, and then in all likelihood, uh, we will go ahead and we will uh, test out the sorting machine and see if we can get it to place items in a few chests here. Uh, but anyway, I will see you all next time.